Hey everyone, it's Sue Brooke here, and I am here with my great friend John Limbacher. Hi, John. How's it going? And it's going awesome. <laughs> I'm so excited to be here. I'm in John's backyard, his amazing backyard. And I wanted to tell you, I know many of you have been watching me for a while, and I talk a lot about the ACT program. So I'm here with the creator of the ACT program. I met John about a year ago. Well, I met him longer than that, but we started working together about a year ago. And he asked me to be in a pilot program to develop his program called ACT. And my life basically changed. <laughs> totally changed. Pretty awesome stuff, isn't oh, it? Oh <laughs> my gosh. And so I'm so excited about it. I can't wait to share some amazing information. So John, you want to tell us a little bit about the ACT program and what we're going to be talking about today? Sure, absolutely. ACT is a marketing protocol. And basically, it's, it's kind of the foundation for a home run marketing campaign. Now, I like to tell people just one home run marketing campaign can and will change your life. And, you know, the reason I created it to begin with was I saw so many people struggling and they didn't know why. And to me, it was like easy. And I didn't realize why it was so difficult for everybody. And then later on, <laughs> I finally figured it out. And it's kind of like an airline pilot. If you ask them how to fly a plane, they'll tell you it's easy. You just get in the cockpit, do this, this, and that. And you and I try it, and we're going to kill everybody on board, right? Yes, we are. <laughs> so it's the same thing with marketing. There's this level of unconscious competency that the gurus have, and they don't know how to translate it. So that's what ACT is. It's a simple translation, so anybody can do it. And it took me quite a while to actually translate that for you guys. <laughs> and Sue so was part of a program to actually create that translation. Because I put the, the ACT marketing protocol together and delivered it about a year ago. And I thought it was awesome. And everybody else thought it was awesome yeah, too. But the reality, what happened when you got home? Oh my gosh, we, he was speaking like doctor, <laughs> scientist language, and we kind of thought we got it, but it wasn't quite where we, we could completely understand it. Yeah, they, they got it, but they couldn't do it. Yes. You know, they were excited about having this cool, great thing, but then to get it to work for them, that was another story. So that's why I created this additional beta program to figure out how to get that to where it was doable for everybody. And that's what we've done. We spent the last year on it, and now we're finally rolling it out. Yes. And, you know, we, we just, we did another test. We ran about 60 people through, and this time I think we got it. And so it is amazing and I've been working a lot of my clients are using the ACT program and they're finally understanding how to speak to their ideal <laughs> avatars and how to get the traffic drive to, driven to them and it's just awesome. So. Yeah, it, it makes such a difference when you know what to do and how to do it. Absolutely. You know everybody is in this this kind of confusion and overwhelm and and the thing I say is profit doesn't have to be painful. <laughs> you know? It doesn't. It doesn't have to. But the thing is, you just don't know what to do. You see all the programs, and you go to all the seminars, and you're all charged up, and you buy all this stuff. But then, you know, you don't, you, you might have all the pieces to the puzzle, but you just don't know how to get it to all work together. And that's what ACT is all about. And, and beyond that, ACT actually covers some things that nobody's talking about. And this is the stuff that ad agencies know. It's kind of like this secret language that they have. And if you look at successful businesses, they all share a common thread. And they all do what the ad agencies do for them. And up until now, this has been exclusively for those big businesses with deep pockets that could afford the ad agencies. And, you know, all the people I'm meeting, they're not in that category. They're trying to get started, and they don't know where to turn. So that's what it's for. That's what it does. And you guys, uh, you should be really excited to be here because you're amongst the first to actually see this and experience this other than our first beta group. So this is, uh, this is for you guys. Yes, I can't wait. So enjoy, and we'll talk to you after the webinar. That's right. So get ready, turn off your cell phones, and, and actually absorb this. Because this, if you don't do anything beyond this, this information right here is going to change your life. Absolutely, and I am attest to that. So enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, hello everybody and welcome to the webinar. We're going to be covering the predictable client getting system today. So this is how to add an extra 100K this year using that system. And here's the kicker, without doing any selling, which is really cool. I know that's why a lot of you guys are here, because if you're anything like me, that thing called selling is something that we're not too fond of. So anyway, congratulations and welcome aboard. We got people from all over here. Just give me a give me a second here to make a couple of shout outs. I want to see who's here from the furthest distance. I'm here in Huntington Beach, California. And we've got a Manchel from Australia. Hopefully that's the way you pronounce that. We have a Lloyd from Germany. Let's see, who else here? We've got Belinda from New York. Nope, that one's not going to make it. We have a Jack from Brisbane. Now, I'm not even sure where that is, but I think, Jack, you might take the cake on this one. We've got some locals here. We've got Stacy from Las Vegas and Keanu from L.A. And anyway, I want to just take a second here and just welcome you guys aboard. This is really exciting. Uh, I want to give you a little bit of background. My name is John Limbacher. And the first time I actually used this system in my own business, I was able to make $139,790 in sales in just 70 minutes. Now, that may sound a little outrageous, and I want to tell you that was from stage. I actually did the presentation on stage. That's not what I'm going to be covering here today, although you could use these, tech, these techniques and tactics for that. If you are a seminar speaker, you can use this stuff. If you want to just automate this and be kind of behind the scenes and not talk to anybody, that's the ones I'm really geared toward. Because what we're looking at is taking this information and creating automated selling systems online and systems for getting new clients into your business, all on autopilot without having to get on the phone, without having to do all of that stuff that makes you feel like a salesman. So anyway, that's what we're at. That's what we're going to go after. And uh, I, got, I got asked to speak at Glazier Kennedy. And I had been doing this stuff for a very long time for other clients. I've been doing this kind of like a mercenary out there, doing internet marketing, search engine optimization, and a lot of stuff like that for other businesses making them a ton of money, and then when I decided to use it for myself, that was my results from the Glacier Kennedy stage. 70 minutes on stage and $139,000 in sales. Now, one thing I do want to say, there is no way I can guarantee any kind of income. Uh, that's, you know, results are completely based on your own efforts. So this is not a, a get-rich-quick scheme. This is really teaching you marketing techniques that actually work. So here's where most of you are. You're in the state of confusion and overwhelm. And, you know, I know what that's like because I've actually been there. I've been through that. I didn't know which road to go, and I went up and down and back and forth until I finally took a step back and looked at what is successful. And that's where the system came from. I've got years and years of experience. I'll get to that in a minute and kind of give you some background of where I got a lot of the information that was able to allow me to put this together for you. And it's really, really powerful. So stick with that. Another thing, too, don't jump off here. Stick with me to the end because I'm going to give you some really cool stuff. And, you know, this is going to change your life. This is going to change your business. If you implement this stuff and you follow the steps and you follow the tactics and, and set a strategy up in your business that actually makes sense and actually works, that's what's going to make the difference for you. And this is going to cut through all of that confusion, and it's just going to give you a clear path ahead. So one thing I do want to tell you is this is absolutely true. One home run marketing campaign can change your life. It can change your business forever. 
And what it does, it gives you that secret recipe that you can reproduce over and over and over. And I'm going to talk a lot about recipes here because that is kind of really the secret underneath all of this is to, to get predictable results, you've got to have recipes. So I was actually in the stadium, that's Albert Pujols, and he hit his 600th career home run that night. And it was incredible. And I mean, the stadium just roared. And that's what it's going to be like when you hit your first home run marketing campaign. Imagine the feeling that you're going to have when you realize your life has changed forever. You now know how to make automated income. You know how to get all the clients you'll ever want. And not just any clients, the clients that you actually want, your dream clients, the ones that bring you 90% of your profit with only 10% of your effort. That's what we're talking about here. And, you know, I was talking about those recipes. It's like footprints in the sand. And this saying has kind of been around for quite some time. The furthest back I could find was when Booker T. Washington said, success always leaves footprints. Now, you've probably heard a different version of that from Tony Robbins, which success always leaves clues. He's just kind of changed it up a little bit. Now, I added my own in there, which failure also leaves footprints or clues. And that is absolutely true. You know, Tony Robbins says, if you want to be successful like someone else, you've got to do what they did to get there. So you've got to follow those footsteps. And those footsteps are like recipes. Recipes are like formulas. If you don't have formulas for your business, you don't get positive outcome. You know, it's like predictability. When you have a recipe that is a winner, you can, you can reproduce that recipe. You can cook that recipe over and over and over, and you get predictable outcomes. It's like McDonald's. You can literally walk into a McDonald's anywhere in the world, order a Big Mac, and it's going to taste exactly the same. That's because they've got a recipe. They've got formulas for everything, and their outcomes are absolutely predictable. So that's what you want to have. You want to have that in your business. Imagine having the recipe book to be able to scale your business just like the big ad agencies. You know, if you ever wonder how businesses get huge, how they grow, and how they become booming successes, it's because they've got a recipe book. And most of them didn't have that to begin with. They were in that state of confusion and overwhelm. And with big business, they kind of have an advantage. A big business has deep pockets. They've got a lot of money. And what they can do, they can kind of short circuit this. They can, they can do a shortcut and they can hire an ad agency. When they go to hire an ad agency, guess what? That ad agency, they have the recipe book, and they're able to take any business and scale it. And basically, with an ad agency, because they've got that recipe book, they can look at your business, they can see what you're trying to do, and they can predict the outcome before they even start. A lot of times what will happen is an ad agency will turn a client away because they know it's going to fail and they don't want that on their record. I do the same thing with SEO. I will not take clients on. I've been doing commercial SEO for over 20 years. And I know because I know this recipe book. I can look at a business because I know this and I can tell if they're going to succeed or if they're going to fail. If they're going to fail, I'm just like the ad agencies. I won't take them on because I don't want that on my record. So. That's really important to have that recipe book. Now that's exactly what we've put together here in the ACT Marketing Protocol. It's every recipe that you would ever need to be able to scale your business. So that's what we're going to go through today. Now, a lot of people ask, how in the world did I get to be a marketing expert from being a search engine guru? You know, I've been one of the guys that's been on the forefront of SEO and search engine optimization back since the mid-90s, before Google even existed, before Yahoo was even online. I was doing SEO using 
AltaVista, Lycos, Webcrawler, and a whole boatload of other small search engines that were the first ones on the scenes. So with that background, how in the world did I get to become a marketing expert? And that's what I'm going to tell you. I actually have a deeper knowledge of this because my experience goes back before the search engine days. These were some of my clients that I worked with in my photography days. I did high-end special effects commercial photography for all of these companies and many, many more. And these are big companies. These guys all hire ad agencies. So I got the privilege of sitting in the boardroom of these ad agencies and watching them work and watching how they did what they did. And it didn't make sense to me at the time, but the knowledge and the education that I got from sitting in on those is absolutely incredible. I didn't know what I was getting at the time, though. It wasn't until years later when I started looking back going, my God, they, they did the exact same thing over and over and over. And since I was in there so many times, I know exactly what it is. I know the recipe for scaling a business because I've seen it over and over and over from all the ad agencies, from all these clients. So <clears throat> when I moved forward, I took that knowledge and I started looking into, okay, what are the internet marketing gurus doing? What are they doing to make millions of dollars online? And I noticed it was the exact same process. There's a three-step process to this. And if you don't get it right, generally you fail. In fact, when I say generally, I mean you fail. There's no way, unless you're just lucky and you happen to get it just by pure happenstance. The problem with that, some people do that. Some people start a business and they're able to scale and it is pure luck. They just happen to get enough things right that it worked. The problem with that is it's not predictable and it's not repeatable. They turn around and they try and do it again and they fall flat on their face because they didn't realize what made it successful to begin with. And that's right out of that recipe book. Now, again, I didn't create this. This goes way back. I ask people, you know, who do they believe the father of advertising is? If you study a lot of advertising, a lot of times you'll hear this guy, David Ogilvy. He's the one that, uh, that got portrayed in Mad Men by Don Draper. This is the, uh, the new TV show that's been very popular, and it's about American advertising, and it goes all the way back to the 50s. And a lot of people think this is the guy. They think this is the guy that made it all happen. But I got to tell you, I did some research, and it goes back even further than this. It goes way back further. In fact, one of the secrets I promised to reveal in here was some recipes, some advertising recipes that are very, very powerful and very, very much at play today that are 276 years old. And that is actually came, those came from the father of American advertising, and that was Benjamin Franklin. In a little bit, I'm going to show you, I'm going to reveal one of the recipes that he used back then to sell his wood-burning stove. And it is one of the most popular and powerful recipes in the advertising book. So you're going to want to stick around and pay attention to that. But anyway, he was back there doing advertisements in 1741, printing them in his general magazine. So that's as far back as I could find in American history of, you know, like the fathers of advertising. And this is it. He's in the Advertising Hall of Fame. <laughs> so most people don't think about him like that. And you know what? If you come to think about it, who's on the $100 bill? He's the only guy on a bill that was not a U.S. president. And they still put him on the biggest bill in circulation today. That means something. You know, a lot of people don't think about that, but why is he on there? Why did he deserve to be on the $100 bill? The biggest bill we have in circulation, and Benjamin Franklin's on there, and he wasn't even a U.S. president. How did that happen? You know, that's somebody that's got some power. That's somebody that knows how to persuade people. <laughs> so pretty cool stuff here. All right, let's get into it. Let's talk about these recipes. 
So there's three different types of recipes in here. There are market recipes, there's message recipes, and there's traffic recipes. So the market comes down to segmentation. You need recipes to be able to segment the market. And this is going to make more sense to you in a minute, but language, the language that you speak, it's that message to the market. That is really, really the key. And if you don't get the first one right, you'll never get the second one right. And once you do, once you identify your most profitable market and you figure out the languaging to speak to that market and, and persuade them, then you'll have a selling system and then it just takes traffic. And traffic just comes down to arithmetic. It really is that simple. So I'm going to give you one of the first steps here. This is one of our first recipes. And this isn't going to be the entire recipe, but it's kind of more the outcome of the recipe. It's identifying your most profitable market. And there's three things here. You've got to look at the size. First of all, the size of your market has to be big enough to support your sales needs. You know, you, you're going to have sales goals where you've got to sell a certain amount of things to be profitable and to be able to be able to be scalable. So you've got to have the right size of a market. The market also has to have the ability to pay. So demographics are important, making sure that you're targeting a market that can afford your product. And then they have to have not only the ability to pay, but the willingness to pay. They actually have to want what you have. That's really important. If you don't get this right and you don't get this segmentation, this is like the cornerstone of your entire marketing campaign. If you fail here, every step you take, every move you make is doomed right from the beginning. So this is probably one of the most important recipes that we have. And let me give you a couple examples because I know you're hearing this, but you might not be seeing it. You might not be quite understanding what I mean by profitable market. Markets are enormous. Like, for instance, the health market. You could be in the health market, but your product is, is a small segment of that. So you've got to find out which segment of that market is the most profitable and which one can you serve the best. And I have that bottle of water over there on the right. And I'm going to use that as the first example. If you are selling really, really expensive water, let's say, let's say your bottle of water was $20. That's kind of a hard sell, a $20 bottle of water. Now, in the, wa in the market for water, obviously everyone drinks water. So I'm going to break it into three key markets here and then see if you can decide which market is the most profitable. So in the first market, we've got the green market, the people that will buy products to save the earth and they're conscious of their environment and they want to just help out humanity. So that's one segment of the market that purchases water. There's another segment that purchases water for performance reasons, like for sports. They believe that you know, the right water can give them a, a competitive edge. Now, that's market number two. And then market number three is the health market, the market where the water actually helps to increase cellular function. So let's say you've got a patient with cancer and they're not getting the right water and their cells are not getting hydrated and they're, they're going to die quicker. You know, if they can have water that hydrates their cells and keeps them healthier and makes them last another day, another week, another month, what's the water worth to that market? So let me ask you, of the three markets, which one do you think is the most profitable market segment? Just go ahead and Type it in the question box there if, uh, if you want to participate. Yeah, that's right. The health, that's the one. If you, could, if you could buy the water and it would extend your life, is it worth $20? Absolutely. That's what I'm talking about. It's that ability to pay and willingness to pay. The guy for the sports, he might be willing to pay that you know, a, a time or two. But the green guy? When you tell him the bottle of water is $20, all of a sudden 
his need to save the earth is going to go right out the window because he's just not going to buy a bottle of water for 20 bucks. So the other one there, I've got a mask, snorkel, and fins. You know, the reason I put that up, this is actually a real-world example of a client that I've had for over 20 years. When they first came to me, they wanted to sell masks, snorkels, and fins to resorts like ho hotels and, and holiday getaway resorts. And basically they were selling them or they were buying them to rent them out. So they bought a lot. So, you know, it was a big market and they bought a lot. They had the ability to pay and the willingness to pay. So that's what we were selling to them for this particular customer of mine. Now, every year we do a customer review and we bring the customer in, see how things are going. And one of the things I ask is how can we do better? How can we make you more profitable? And he said, well, if we sold water slides, my profit is in water slides. And I'm like, well, that would have been nice to know, you know, a year ago when we started the campaign. So anyway, we re-optimized this campaign and started getting him customers and leads for water slides. And the first thing that happened, he got a phone call on a Saturday in his office. And the woman on the other end of the line said, this is Celine Dion. And he thought it was a joke and he hung up on her. And so she called right back, and she said, no, really, this is Celine Dion. And he says, well, you know, how can I help you? And she says, I'm looking for a water slide for my backyard. And he, he was really flabbergasted. And he said, well, how did you hear about me? And she said, well, I Googled you, and you were number one for water slides. So anyway, long story short, she wound up flying him out to her place in Las Vegas, and he put a million-dollar water slide in her backyard and there's a picture of it right there pretty cool he was so excited about that he wanted to sell water parks now <laughs> and I was like my god can you even do a water park and he said oh yeah absolutely I have everything I need to be able to do a water park so we readjusted his campaign and next thing you know he actually got a client for a water park in Dubai that was a hundred million dollar project. So that's what happens when you target your ideal clients and you find the most profitable segment of the market. And that leads us to what we're going to talk about next is step two, which is defining your avatar. Now, a lot of you have heard about this. A lot of you have heard of avatars and don't really know what it is. You don't have clarity on what that means. So. Let me just make it simple. An avatar is nothing more than a representation of your ideal client. And when I say ideal client, I mean your most profitable customers. And if you're already in business, you may know who this is because you probably have them and you're working with them already. But if you don't, it's really important that you identify who you want to work with because if you don't, if you don't get this step right, you're going to wind up with this guy as your client. And he's going to be a nightmare. He's going to chew up all of your time, and he's not going to bring you any profit. So if you already have this guy, let's say you already have an existing business, and you're dealing with guys like this, what you want to do is you want to fire them. They're bad clients. They, they're hurting your business. What you want to do is you want to be able to attract ideal clients, and you do that with your message. So one of the things in, a, in an avatar, in creating an avatar, is you've got to create the timeline. The timeline is basically where your avatar is currently and where they want to be. They probably have some difficulty or some trouble, and there's hurdles to get there. So we're going to talk about that in a little bit. But anyway, you need to understand what their timeline is. You also need to understand what their level of awareness is. There's a lot of people out there with big problems, and they aren't even aware of it. So sometimes just making them aware of it and then taking them through an education system will be the way to go. So you have to understand that. If you're working and trying to identify your ideal clients, You've got to know where they're at. 
you've also got to understand their wants, emotions, and beliefs. So that's really important that you identify those. And guess what? There's recipes for all of that. We have recipes for every step of the way here. So here's the timeline, and there's what I kind of described, the current situation followed by milestones and hurdles to get to their desired outcome. If your product or service supplies that desired outcome, then you want to get this timeline figured out. You want to know what are the milestones and hurdles so you can build that into your marketing message because you can, you can create trust and rapport with your customer if you describe that, if you have walked a mile in their shoes and you know what they're feeling, they will bond with you and they'll want to buy from you. Here's the level of awareness pyramid. And down at the bottom, you'll notice that's the completely unaware and there's the most people down there. That also is the biggest opportunity. Up in the most aware, that's where they're ready to buy the product. They're ready to make a purchase. Notice there's fewer up there, and notice the length of time it takes if you're working from the completely unaware. If your customers are higher up in here, it's a shorter time to the sale. But the opportunity is smaller. So we get into that. We break that all down with recipes to figure out where your ideal customers are in this and where you start your marketing message and how you walk them through, how you move them from whatever level they are up to the most aware where they're ready to make a purchase. Okay, I talked about wants, emotions, and beliefs. And this is really kind of the core of the system. This is where you figure out how to really speak their language. And when you look at wants, wants always come from the heart. You know, emotions are what seduce the heart. So you've got to be able to tie into that. And beliefs are what come from the head. That is the objections. So unless you can convince the head with logic, you're never going to get the heart what it wants. The head's always going to get in the way and say no. So these beliefs are what you have to overcome because those are their objections. And I've got that formula there, that C plus P plus, plus B. That's an actual formula that we have, recipe, so to speak. And that's the one that Benjamin Franklin came up with. And I'm going to get to that in a minute. You're really going to want to stick around to learn that because that is so powerful. It's unbelievable. So here's language. This is basically what can create demand and desire for your product, is getting this message to market correct. And I have a statement there, great marketing makes sales superfluous. If your marketing message is creating that demand and desire, you don't need to make sales. People are ready to buy. Let me ask you this, how many people that are salespeople work in a McDonald's? When was the last time you went into a McDonald's and were met by a salesman? They don't exist. McDonald's doesn't need salespeople. The reason is they've used recipes in their marketing to create demand and desire for their product. So when you walk through the door at McDonald's, you're not met by a salesperson. You're met by an order taker. They're simply there to take your order. How cool would that be in your business? Let me ask you this. <laughs> in your business, what would you prefer? Would you prefer to do sales calls and pull your hair out for the next 10 years? Or would you prefer to answer the phone and take orders like McDonald's does? The only difference here is a marketing protocol. It's the way you set up your marketing. If you set up a strategy in your business that creates marketing, that gets your phone to ring and gets people to place orders without a salesperson. That is a marketing protocol that can be an absolute home run for your business. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're leading up to here. So here's what your marketing should do. It should seduce the heart 
with claims, promises, and emotions. And then it needs to convince the head with proof, features, and benefits. That's basically the key to success in marketing. You want to lead your prospect through a learning process where they discover that your solution is absolutely perfect for them. That's an education-based marketing system. You've probably been hearing about this because it's becoming very popular now in the online space. People are figuring it out. So this system is so you don't have to go through that learning curve and try and figure this stuff out, which could take years. You see a lot of people doing it, but you don't know the steps. There's a lot of little tweaks and recipes in the middle of all of this. And if you don't know them, you're going to wind up being in that confusion and overwhelm. So here it is. This is that 276-year-old recipe that I spoke of. He talked about the science of heat and heat transmission. Now that's a claim. He talked about that. He was saying it. That makes it a claim. Then he called upon authorities to reinforce his arguments. That's proof. And then he highlighted the helpful benefits. So that's the formula. Claim, proof, and then benefits. That was his formula. And that is still at work today. And it's very, very powerful. I spoke of education-based marketing. And there's four types of beliefs that your client is going to need to purchase from you. And sometimes those beliefs need to be swayed. And that's how you do that with the claim proof benefit. That is how you reinstall new beliefs. So the four beliefs that they have or they need to have is they've got beliefs in themselves. Now, if they have a belief in themselves that they can't do it, it's going to be really hard for you to sell to them. So you might have to use claim proof benefit to alter and create a new belief. That's what it's for. That's what it does. Oh, next they're going to have beliefs in the market. You know, what does the market say? What do they believe about the market? And then they're going to have beliefs about you. You know, do they believe that you've done this before? Do they believe that you know how to do it? And sometimes that's going to be no. So if they have that belief, you're going to need to change that before they'll purchase from you. And then they've got beliefs in your product. Will the product work? Will it work for me? And you've got to install those beliefs so they have those four types of beliefs that they need to be able to purchase from you. So. In the claim proof benefit plus claim proof benefit plus claim proof benefit equals sale. The more claims and proofs and benefits that you need to match a higher priced item. So it's like the higher the, the, higher the price of your item, the more convincing you're going to need to make a sale. So you might need six of them. You might only need one of them. Doesn't really matter you still need to install those beliefs to make a sale. And then proof. The proof comes in here, and you can use third party is really, really strong for this. You can use like market data, you can use like news clips right out of the news for this. You can use social proof, you can use their own experience, like maybe you know they've already tried this and failed, so you can call upon that. And then you can use market proof. Like you can say, you know, the, there's 10,000 people a day that are, are dying from cigarette smoke. You know, that's market proof. Those are statistics that are available in the market. So you want to use that proof. And you want to have two proof points. When you have one claim, you follow it up with two proof points and then three benefits. And I'm going to get to the benefits in a minute and show you the formula that we use to create three-dimensional benefits that sell like crazy. So use these claims to install or replace those beliefs that you need to get them to buy your product. That's what you want to do. All right, I talked about that three-dimensionalizing of the benefits. 
So you need three different benefits. You need functional, dimensional, and emotional. And the reason that you need three is you want them to hear it, see it, and feel it. If you can get them to hear it, see it, and feel it, they're going to want it. So let me give you an example here, because I know that's probably a little vague and a little cloudy for you. But they hear it, see it, and feel it. I'm just going to, I'm going to pick on the diet industry for a minute here, just to give you a really strong example. And with the diet industry, you know, the whole thing there is you got diet pills. And, you know, they're, they're selling you the idea of losing weight. But that's where they leave the benefit off, and that's just hearing it. Hearing it is not near as powerful as seeing it and feeling it. So when we put this together, your, your benefit would go from, you know, take the pill and lose weight, which is kind of a claim. It's also the benefit because that's what they want. They want to lose the weight. But watch what happens when we three-dimensionalize it. So the hear it part is you're going to lose weight. That's the hear it. Now the see it, I'm going to call upon their acute memory to bring up a picture. I'm going to say, imagine looking in the mirror, seeing yourself 20 pounds lighter. They know what that looks like because they weren't always that weight. They've been looking in the mirror for years. So they know what they look like when they were 20 pounds ago. So now they're going to hear it and now they're going to see it because that picture is immediately going to be brought up in their head. Whatever that looks like to them, they're going to see it. They can't not see it. You know, whenever you hear something, you, you take that in and you internalize it with pictures. So they're going to see that image. All you have to do is bring it up on the screen for them. And you can do that by saying, imagine looking in the mirror and seeing yourself 20 pounds lighter. They know what that looks like. So now they've heard it, they've seen it. Now let's feel it. Now, this is where that first part of your avatar becomes really important because you need to know why they want this. Now, it might be a woman that's going to her class reunion. She's hitting her 20-year class reunion, and she doesn't want to be 20 pounds overweight. So when we get her to feel it, we say, imagine what it's going to feel like when you walk into the room and heads turn and they notice you look sensational. So that's how you wrap it all together, the hear it, see it, feel it. When you put your benefits together in that way, that literally changes everything. That's going to change everything about your marketing. You're not going to have to sell because they're going to want it. That creates that demand and desire for what you're offering. It literally works like magic. So. That's what you want to do. Now, there's another piece to this that's really important, and that's what we call the unique mechanism. This is the thing that delivers the, the results. This is the thing that does the work. So you make a promise. Like, again, I'm going to just stick with the diet thing because we're on a theme here. So to make a point, the promise is take the pill and lose weight. Now, the first time they ever heard that, it was great because they believed it. They didn't have any reason not to. But as you know, the diet pill has been around for who knows how many years, and everyone knows it doesn't work. So they know that. That's a belief that they have. They've already tried it. They've experienced it. It didn't work for them. So what you have to do is you have to come in with what makes yours different. You know, a lot of people call this the unique selling proposition, but nobody knows what that means. You know, all they say is, you know, what's different about yours? But we want to know what it is, not just what's different about it, but what's the thing that yours has that delivers the result. So what you can do there, like the idea of a diet pill, diet pill, that originally was the unique mechanism. The pill was what you took, and the pill did the work, and the pill got the results. Everybody found that to be not true. So next is somebody got the brilliant idea to come out with Garcinia Cambogia. So now their diet pill has a unique mechanism. It's 
my pill works because it's got Garcinia Cambogia that does the work to get you the results. That's the active ingredient in there that's going to be different, and that's what's going to get you what you didn't get before. And the reality is, and this goes back to David Ogilvy and the, the whole Mad Men thing, it's not about having a different product. It's about who says it first. Because the truth is, all those pills had the Garcinia Cambogia. It's just no one said it. So at that point, it's a, it's a bidding war. You know, you're in a bloodbath where everyone is just price shopping because all the diet pills look the same. But when all of a sudden you say ours has Garcinia Cambogia, and that's what makes it different, that's what's going to make it work for you, now all of a sudden you've got the thing that they want because they really want the result. They just don't believe the diet pill is going to give it to them. And now you've reinstalled that belief that yours will. Now, what happens when everybody says our diet pill has Garcinia Cambogia? Well, you just have to step it up. What's your unique mechanism now? And you could say our Garcinia Cambogia is cold pressed, where the others in the market are heat treated and it kills the active ingredient that actually delivers the result. So you want ours. It's the only one that works. So again, this, this unique mechanism is very powerful. And then it comes down to arithmetic. And let me just kind of go over this because a lot of people aren't familiar with this type of conversation. And it's all about conversion. It's how many people does it take to convert one to a customer. And one of the things that you need in this equation is your cost per click. If you're doing advertising out on the internet, you're buying people to get to your site. The reason you're doing that is so you can have the ability to convert them to customers. So let's just say for the, for the sake of our simple math here that your cost per click is 50 cents. So what that means is a 1% conversion. If you had one out of 100, that 50 cent click would be a $50 cost of conversion. So it takes, if it takes 100 people to click to get one to bank a purchase, that's a 1% conversion. So let's say the thing that you're selling is a $97 item. So that's your customer value at this point. And your cost of goods is really nothing because it's an electronic product. Let's, so let's just take the cost of goods out of it for a minute. Let's say there's $97 customer value. Now you have to take the profit out of there. You've got to take the traffic cost. So what you take out there is you take out the $50 that it took to get the 100 clicks to get the one sale. So that leaves you with a $47 profit. Now, if you just increased your conversion to 2%, look at what it does to your profit. It takes you up to 72%, or $72 rather. So you just went from $47 profit to $72 profit just with a single percent conversion change. When you start three-dimensionalizing your benefits and you start using a unique mechanism, you're going to get higher conversions. You're going to be more profitable. You're going to get people to purchase on autopilot without having to do sales. So that's what you get with proven recipes. Now, let's, uh, I want to ask you this. What do you think happens when you don't follow the recipe? Or you, let's say you don't even have a recipe and you're just doing things by happenstance. What do you think would happen? That's right. You have a recipe for disaster. If you're not going to follow the recipe, follow the steps, follow the formulas to run a successful business that is scalable, this is what you're going to get. You're going to get a recipe for disaster. Now, proof to that, that's a claim, so let me just follow it up with proof here. This is out of Forbes magazine. It says 80% of businesses are gone within 18 months. And this article actually goes in and says why they're gone within 18 months. And it follows exactly what I'm saying here. 
because they're not following the steps. It's because they don't have the market right, because they don't get the message right, or they don't have the traffic. It's exactly what I've been talking about. So this is what your business will look like if that's your plan. If your plan is to not follow the recipes, not have a strategy, and just kind of wing it, you're going to go up like the Hindenburg. And, and nobody wants that. I mean, what do we really want? We want the recipe for success. That's what we're all after. And I got to tell you, when you get this right, when you've got a recipe and you've got a formula and you follow it and you get things right, you, you get your conversions there and you find out you can scale your business, that literally gives you a money printing machine. When you say, okay, I can put $2 in and I can get $3 back, how many times a day would you want to do that? Would you just fire this machine up full speed and let it run till it just blew up? That's what I would do. <laughs> so that's what you want. You want a scalable system. You want a system that you can put money in, buy traffic, and let your system automatically convert those into customers. That's what we're talking about here. And that is the ACT Marketing Protocol. It's every recipe you need to do just that. And I, you know, I, I kind of turn this into a, a little bit of humor here. I say ACT is like the little blue pill for business. You know, it's like Viagra for your business. If you need to get your sales up, this will do the trick. <laughs> so it's, you know, it, it really is. It's a step-by-step -step solution for you, and it's the only thing that you need to live financially free because when you get marketing right in your business and you have conversion and you have a marketing system that can create demand and desire for your products and turn them, convert them into customers, that's a scalable business. That's a real business. And one of the things I say is profit doesn't have to be painful. When you've got somebody guiding you and you've got formulas and you don't have to figure it out, you don't have to be in that state of confusion and overwhelm, then I say profit doesn't have to be painful. You know, wouldn't you like to get out of that overwhelm? You're, I know why you're in the state of confusion and overwhelm because you're hearing so many different things from so many different people and the truth is they're all just trying to sell you their stuff and they're really good at it. They know how to do this. They know how to create a successful marketing campaign. They know how to create demand and desire for their product and you buy it and it's good stuff. But the thing is, it's all a bunch of tactics. It's not tied to an overall strategy for your business. And that's why you're in that confusion and overwhelm. But it doesn't have to be painful. Now that you know what it takes to, to put together a home run marketing campaign that can literally change your life and your business, and you have access to all the recipes to make it happen, Success lies just ahead, and that really is true. You guys now know what it takes, and you've got access to the system, and that's what's going to make it happen for you. So at this point, if it's okay with you, I'd just like to take a minute here and show you what's included in the system. So here it is. This is the three-step system that we call ACT. And if you haven't got it yet, ACT stands for Analysis, Creation, and Traffic. And I see so many people jumping into creation. They want to create a website. They want to drive traffic. But they haven't analyzed their market, so they don't even know who they're selling to. How could you create a successful marketing message unless you knew everything about the person you were trying to sell to? How would that work in the real world? How would that work if a salesperson didn't know anything about who they were trying to sell to. How effective do you think they would be? A really good salesman, that is his most powerful asset, is being able to know who he's talking to and know what they want. He does that by asking questions. We don't have that luxury. We've got to figure it out ahead of time so we can automate the process. So in the three-step system, you have complete 
video training. This is literally me walking you by the hand through every step of the process. We cover analysis. There's a bunch of little pieces to analysis. And they're covered under three segments. And the first, like I said, is the market segmentation, followed by avatar creation, and then your competitor analysis, figuring out what are your competitors saying. Because if you don't know that, you won't be able to craft a superior offer. You won't know how to craft your unique mechanism. So it's really important that we understand what the market is saying out there so we know how to fit in. And then once we get that section done and complete, then we move into creation. And in here, I show you exactly how to create high demand products if you don't have them. How to create products that will integrate in with what else you do. Sometimes they're products that will lead them into the sale. Sometimes it's add-on products for more profit. We get into stuff like the big idea and the hook. The big idea really is the hook that gets them to look. You know, that's your advertisement. And then I show you exactly how to craft irresistible offers. We go through copywriting, how to do headlines, leads, landing pages, sales vehicles, order forms, the whole bit, I walk you through piece by piece, step by step, exactly how to do this to put an automated online selling system in play. And then once you have that, then we move into traffic. And in traffic, the fastest path to cash is just to buy your traffic. You can do it through search engines with pay-per-click. You can do it with Facebook ads. You can do it instantly, immediately, and you can turn it on and off like a light switch. So you can test, you can buy little bits of traffic to test, get your conversion numbers, and then scale it. And if any time, if at any time at all, you decide you need to stop for some reason, you can stop it instantly. You can fix whatever problem you had, and then turn it right back on when you're ready. So this is really kind of a blueprint, and you're going to get this. This is the predictable client getting system. This is the ACT marketing protocol. As you see, it's analysis, creation, and traffic. Down the right side, you'll see the breakdown of the blueprint of the entire system. You get video training modules on every piece of that. It's me walking you through step by step over 30 recipes. And these recipes are formulas for success. If you look at any online marketing campaign today that's successful, you'll see every one of these in play. And now you'll know how to do them for yourself. How powerful is that? That is power at your fingertips. So also included here, I've got a quick start guide because a lot of people jump in and they just don't even know where to start. And I make it simple. I say, here, do this first, followed by that, and just work you right through the system. You actually have a workbook, an ACT workbook, with worksheets for everything. And you can literally print these out and handwrite in them. I know a lot of people are still old school. I'm one of them. I love to write stuff with pen and paper. It somehow really solidifies things for me. If that's not you, that's perfectly fine. We've got it in a Word document, so you can do it online. So however you like it, it's there for you. We also have a thing called the Freedom Formula. And this is a lesson and a worksheet to go through the process of figuring out how many products you would have to sell to get to your freedom number. And your freedom number really is your ideal lifestyle. It's how much would you have to scale your business to get you where you really want to go. And there's the formula to figure all that out. And then we've got a complete resource guide of all the tools and services that we actually use in our business for scalable success. And we share that with you. There's no, there's no guesswork. There's no hunting around. It's like we've used everything imaginable, and we have basically settled on all the best stuff. So you can just follow our footsteps, follow our recipes, 
follow this and get the same outcome. It's just like McDonald's. They follow a formula and they get predictable results. So you'll be able to do that with the system. Also, we have cheat sheets and swipe files. A lot of the stuff that we do is included so you can see how we've done it. A lot of the marketing that we've already done, I go through and literally break out each piece and tell you what it's for, why it's there, how it fits into the analysis, where it came from, everything. We've got webinar templates, traffic cheat sheets, uh, funnel cheat sheets, you know, for making your marketing funnel, all of that. The total value of this, and, and here's the thing, I don't play this value game where I start adding a bunch of stuff up and tell you this is worth $50,000 and then start slashing the price. I don't really know what the value of all this stuff is. It, it, it's priceless if it gets you to your ideal lifestyle. So I just tell you the price. And, you know, I'm, like I said, I'm not one of these marketers that's going to jack everything up and then cut it down. The price of the ACT system is $19.97. Now, for you guys today, I'm going to allow you to get access to it, and I don't discount the system. And again, I'm not discounting it here, but I'm going to allow you guys to get access to it at a, at a different amount today. So let me tell you about that, because that's really interesting, and I'll get to that in a minute, of how I'm going to get you access at the same price but for less without discounting it. It's really cool. But also, when you get into the ACT system and you are an ACT participant, we run two-day live implementation events a couple of times a year, two, three, four, depending on how many people that we've got in the system at any given time. And what it is, it's two days live with me actually implementing the system into your business. And all we charge for this event, the only people that even get to go to this event are people that have the ACT protocol. It's just $99 for each person. Now, a lot of people ask me, can I bring my partner? Can I bring my team? And the answer is yes. You can bring anybody that's involved in your business. All you have to do is just buy an additional event ticket for anyone in your team and they are all just $99 each. The reason that we charge $99 is covers the food and the course materials for the two days. So this is not a money maker for us. This is so you can actually get this in play as quickly as possible with the least amount of confusion and overwhelm. Because that's our job is to eliminate that. You also get free readmittance to all future live events. And when I say free, you're invited back to any of them. You still have to pay the $99 fee because, again, that covers your food and your course materials for the two days. You also get video recordings of our last live event. So once you get into the program, you'll have access to our last live event recordings. And our next one is chalked up for October in Orange County for our next live event. So if you get in on it now, you'll be able to sign up for that October event and get in there and spend the two days and really put this into play. Also, this is something that no one else does. You know, they tell you you get lifetime access, but the truth is, as soon as they get this thing delivered, that's it. They go on to the next thing. I have been running live support for everyone in my community since 2008. I am literally on a call with my community every week, every Thursday. I do a live call for one hour where I answer any questions and help you over any hurdles that you're having. And the only thing I charge for that is $29.97 a month. So for under 30 bucks a month, you can literally put me on your team. I can answer questions for you. I can answer questions for any of your staff members that are doing the work for you. And it's anything at all, anything to get you moving forward. 
if you're stuck on something, get on that call and get unstuck. We also have 24-7 support in our forum. We have a community website exclusively for our members, and we also occasionally do video conference focus groups for people that are along to certain stages of their, of their marketing campaign. And I can do reviews on there. Like one of the things I highly suggest is having me do a review before you start buying traffic. There's things I'm going to see that you probably won't see yourself. So get on there and take advantage of that. We also have what we call our 100K Club membership. And I'm going to talk about that in a minute. We give you full access to our Internet Dominator Club community. That's for search engine optimization, should you want to take advantage of that. Uh, you might have people in your business that do search engine optimization. Feel free to run them through there. That will help, the, help you with all your SEO efforts. Now, again, we focus mostly on paid traffic in this program because it's instant and it's immediate. But if you've got an ongoing business that's been around for a long time, and you need that search engine support, that also is included. So here it is. Now, I told you how you were going to be able to get in and get it for less. The price is still $19.97. But for you guys, I'm doing a results in advance offer. So you guys can get into the program, get access to everything today for just $4.97. We defer the second payment until after you've made your first 100000 with the marketing campaign that you create from using the ACT program. That is what we're doing for you guys. So think about that. You're getting complete access for $497. You're, you're able to take me home with you. You've got me on all the, the videos walking you step by step through the process. You've got me on calls every Thursday to help you get unstuck, help you move forward through the process to get you there as quickly as possible, all for $4.97 to get into the program. And again, that second payment is not due until after you've made $100,000 running your first marketing campaign. Now, if you break that down, it's $1.36 a day. Now, Ask yourself, is this worth $1.36 a day to actually create, be able to create and have the knowledge and the know-how and the tools to make your business scalable for just $1.36 a day? What else could you buy? If you don't buy this, what are you going to use that $1.36 a day for? You could get a couple bites of a Big Mac, you, you know, a couple bucks more, you could get the whole thing. But it's that ridiculous how inexpensive this is to get you what you really need to scale your business. So here's the 100K thing. Yeah, so I talked about the 100K club. For every new group that we run through, we do a thing called the 100K challenge. And the first person in the group to get their 100K, to get through there, they actually win this gold bar, which is a $100,000 bill replica in 24 karat gold. It's plated with 24 karat gold. So pretty cool prize and the 100k club is pretty cool also because once you're in there you've made 100k using the program and you're able to coach. I will actually pay you to coach other people in the program to get to their 100k level. So it's a really cool thing. It, it gives you the status of being in the 100K club. Get you, you know, if you're there first in your group, you get this bar. You get this as a, as a prize. And then you get to help others get to that level where you got. So it's really cool. And, you know, we do things with them where, you know, we'll go out on vacations and only people that, that are invited to go will be these 100K club members. So it's kind of a, a cool little elite group. You know, you're probably wondering, what if I get in and it's not what I want? We've got a thing called the Shark Bite Guarantee. And this is literally, if you get in for any reason, 
in the first 30 days. It's a 30-day, 100% money-back guarantee. And all you have to do, if there's for any reason you decide you don't want the program, all you have to do is call up and tell us the shark bit it. And we will refund you 100%, no questions asked. It's that simple. I mean, there's absolutely no risk on your part. We're removing the risk. We're allowing you to get in for just $4.97. And it should be just a no-brainer. It should be an absolute no-brainer to take this offer. This is what you've been missing. This is what you need to get to the next step. This is what you need to eliminate the confusion and overwhelm. We will lead you through the process step by step to get you to that first marketing campaign. And once you get your first one, the rest will become easy. So another thing, what I want to throw in, I want to throw in a fast action bonus here. And that is a 30-minute free one-on-one -on -one private consult with me. I will literally get on the phone with you for 30 minutes and we'll go through your business. We'll kind of figure out and set a preliminary strategy for you of how you're going to get to this point, how you're going to get your first marketing campaign in place. We'll go through. I can usually get to the facts really quickly. So this will be cool. This will get you on track and get you into the system as a fast action bonus. This is the fast track right here. So. If you're interested at this point and you want to jump in on this and you want to get the free 30-minute one-on-one with me, you want to get everything we've talked about, you simply go to internetdominators.com forward slash act now. And the now, you all know what the act stands for, analysis, creation, and traffic. But you don't know what the now stands for. And now stands for no other way. There's no other way that you're going to get a scalable, predictable client getting system without using recipes. And this is every recipe that you're ever going to need for that. So another fast action bonus is I'm going to give you some free templates that work with ClickFunnels. ClickFunnels is one of the tools that we use to create the marketing campaigns. And I'm going to give you some free templates that literally you could swap out. The copy is already done. The calls to action are already done. The headlines are already done. The formula is in place for you to take your stuff out of your analysis and swap it out and create that home run marketing campaign. For instance, you're going to get the webinar funnel that I use to get you here today. I will give you that. It's a, it's a ClickFunnels template, and that's one of the free funnel templates that you're going to get. So how was that? Amazing, isn't it? I'm telling you guys, I did this program, and I was kind of at a point where I wanted to sell things online, and I wanted to, to make it successful. And I tried a bunch of different programs just like everyone else. I had friends that were trying all these other programs, spending so much money going to so many uh, seminars and oh my gosh crazy and this is the one that I just went oh my gosh it is the most amazing program it changed my life it's easy and I'm telling you everybody needs to do it. You almost didn't come too didn't you? I almost didn't come but he wow. convinced me and thank God <laughs> so thank you so much John I'm telling you so I hope you guys really enjoyed this please click the, click the link below to um, to actually take advantage of this awesome program and uh, any last words John? Yeah, I think that that pretty much says it all. You know, a lot of people wonder, will this really work for me? And this is the one that will. This is this is like the strategy behind it all. You can buy all the other programs, and they're just tactics. But unless they're tied to a solid strategy, nothing that you that you buy is really going to work. If you're just buying pieces to a puzzle, you don't know what the picture looks like. That's what most people are doing. So this is the strategy, this is where you paint the picture, you get the pieces you need, you plug them in, and away you go. Yes, I love that you said that, by the way, I wanted to really hone that in when he said that the strategies and, and the tactics. A lot of us, we want to go out there and just do all these things that people tell us to do, 
but we're not really thinking about the strategy behind it. And that's what this program will give you. It'll give you an amazing strategy so you know why you're doing all the things that you're supposed to do. So that's what made the light bulb go off in my head, is it, how to do that and how to speak that language, how to use the words correctly and just everything in the right order. And like you said, it has to be done in the right order. And um, it's just an amazing program. Well, once you create your strategy, when your strategy appears, your confusion and overwhelm disappears. That's what it's all about. <laughs> it is all about that. <laughs> it's changed my life, literally. So, um, really. So, uh, I hope you enjoy it. Please click the link below. Um, go to makemoneywhileisleep.com or click the link right here on the video. And I look forward to working with you face-to-face, one-on-one. I'm there for you every step of the way. So any challenge you're going to come up against, this isn't a program that you buy it and then they send you home. You you get to take me home with you. Absolutely. So. And thank you for reminding me because honestly, there's no other program that you're going to buy that is going to have the actual creator that you can talk to every week. You can actually answer he will answer the questions for you and help you walk through it. I'm, I'm telling you, there's nothing like that. And yeah. I'm super passionate about it. So Yeah, I will actually help you create your strategy and make sure that it's right before you start going down the path. So if you have that confusion and overwhelm, let's just blow that right off. We're going to fix that. <laughs> so I look forward to working with you guys and hope to see you there. Great. Thanks, John. Thank you.